Alexandria, thanks. And voters will have their say in White House about whether marijuana cultivation or sales will be allowed in the village. Right now, neither is allowed. My team reporter Sean Haggerty breaks down the vote. He's joining us live with that. Sean. Diane, this is not a binding election. It's more taking the temperature of the voters here in White House. Will the village be part of the rollout of marijuana? Can you use medical or recreational marijuana in White House? Yes. Can you grow, cultivate, or sell it? No. Now, should that mindset change? It's really hearing the will of the people. That's going to inform council action thereafter. The village currently has a moratorium on production and sales of marijuana. It's just a few years old. Voters this November will have an advisory election in front of them. Should White House keep that? or have the thoughts on marijuana changed? This is so significant. We believe this should not be restricted to council decision. This should be really a voter decided uh, issue. This ballot issue is not legally binding. It's more of a guidance from the residents to council. Village Administrator Jordan Doherty says the company has approached the village in the last few years, but the moratorium squashed any discussion. If another opportunity comes up, council and the mayor want to be ready with the information and the voice of the voters. Whether we allow it or not is going to impact, impact everybody. If the vote is over 50% for cultivation, that does not take the moratorium away. This is not automatic. It's more of a piece of information for the council members if that moratorium does come back up for reconsideration, Lee.